<laughs> All right. Well, welcome viewers. This is the Dead Man's Hand 420 on YouTube. My Twitch, if you uh, make sure you follow, of course. My Twitch is Bill Compton underscore eighteen thirty five. And if you ever want to game with me, you can add me on PSN. My PSN is Bill underscore Compton eighteen thirty five. Today I'm doing a dual playthrough of Final Fantasy X, one of the best games ever made. Uh, I am on episode 19, and I am here with one of my good friends. General, General Dash Chaos Dash Dash One is my PSN. The General Chaos is my Twitch, and General Chaos Gaming is my YouTube. Not too much on the Twitch or the YouTube currently, because I just kind of started them. But bear with me, I will get you more. Yeah, you know, it'll just take a, another thousand years and another attack by sin but you know he'll have his youtube by then you know his twitch streaming hey, hey, hey you know what <laughs> hey, if i live that long i hey i deserve the slack that's all i'm saying but, all right so uh uh first of all i want to get your thoughts before we move on on uh, the first big attack by sin and also just the cutscene itself uh what are, what are your thoughts well, I mean, as you discussed and you were kind of describing the game to me, I mean, considering this game was made from 99 to 2001, it said, I mean, we've got games out now where the, the cutscenes aren't as good as what we're getting in this game. Um, my God, like, if the, cut, if the gameplay cut were as good as the cutscenes, oh, my God, like, it would be insane. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, uh, gra graphic-wise for the time, it's very good, I would say. It's ahead of its time, especially since this was one of the earlier PS2 titles, I want to say. So, yeah. uh, very hard to knock the graphics. And even, like I said, even now, they hold up now even fairly well. I mean, you know, there, there are some minor things if you want to nitpick, like Tidus's chain, like where it's, you know, not 3D or whatever. But that's really nitpicking. Um, in terms of the storyline so far, I like it, um, but Square Enix does, usually does a really good job with their storyline, so uh, I'm not surprised by that, but it is good. I'm enjoying it thoroughly so far. Awesome, awesome. Uh, so we're going to go up this little uh, dirt path here. We're going to be continuing the hold story. On, hold on, hold on, oh. hold on, hold oh. on. When you say awesome, you got to say it with a little bit more enthusiasm. Awesome! awesome. <laughs> hey, I came to play. That's right. <laughs> That's right. All right, so we are progressing forward up this path toward the red arrow. Yes, I'm uh, heading up that way now, going right over near the red arrow even more. Okay, uh, and then uh, just FYI, uh, we should probably cut this clip a little short because I forgot to save it before you did your intro, so I've, you know, um, okay. I'm going to be a little bit longer on the clip. Okay, uh, and then we're going to talk to these people here on the uh, on the left, or? Yeah, she'll heal you again. I don't know if we need to be healed, but it's not a bad thing, so. I don't know, like 57 people just died, so it might be a good idea. <laughs> even though we just threw, even though we just threw that save, so. But hey, you know, <laughs> better safe than sorry. Which yeah, it's the uh, policy these crusaders don't go by. <laughs> and then uh, Awaka's on the right. If you want to talk to him. Yeah, I'm just talking to these three guys that are down there by what's your face. Oaka. Oh, oh, and I'm oh, actually going to buy some Phoenix Downs here. I'm actually down to three Phoenix Downs. I did not notice that. Um, yeah. Uh, I don't know how many I have. Because I've got seven, but yeah, it won't hurt to have a few more. Oh, that's why. Okay, I was so confused earlier in the game how it has the left number and the right number. Like, because I, I think I had two to buy three then it went from three to five and then it went from like two to four and i'm like what's up with this math like <laughs> <laughs> but uh yeah now that i see that i have seven in stock i'm buying three more that shows me the total i will have afterward okay All right yeah game's not a dumbass i am 
And then uh, right. let me know when you when you're coming up to that uh, the party up there. They're waiting on us, so I assume there's a cutscene right here. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm sure that there is. I'm done. Okay. All right. Uh, now, did you go up to Walker yet or no? Cause no. I'm start heading that way. Okay, I'm no. headed towards Walker right now. All right. Um, yeah, it's going to a cutscene. Yep. Well, they're all galling around me. They're about to stop the shit. Oh, no. Hello, noob. Goodbye, noob. <laughs> Holy shit, he speaks. <laughs> oh my god, she just had the exact same reaction. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah. She tries harder. It's one of those guys where it's like he rarely speaks, but when he does, like, you know, it's very powerful yeah. and you better listen type stuff. Smile, let me see. Uh oh. <laughs> Damn sandwich. <laughs> we'll throw a save right here. Uh, it's there for a reason. Yeah. So. Right. Yeah. Oh no, no, not new data. Not new data. No. Do you want to take new? Override. There we go. Yeah. Oh. <sighs> you know, after all that length waiting to hear Kamari speak, I wish they would have gave him a better voice. To be honest with you. Yeah, like, it's not bad, but I was really hoping to be like something more stoic, like that dude from like 300 or something. <laughs> <laughs> like something like that just really fucking reverberates or whatever. Like, I don't know, like how else to put it really. Alright, I'm gonna kill this lizard thing. Actually, I'm gonna use skill. Yeah, I just hit a battle uh, too. Got, okay. Yeah. Uh, I was gonna um, use my. I was gonna extract power, but I forgot I'm already maxed out on those, so. Uh, yeah, I could actually extract yeah. ability here, probably. Oh, yeah, I can do ability, no problem. You know, I'm just gonna have. Uh, yeah, no, I can definitely use ability spears. Always and always. Come on, one hit him, Kamari. Nice. Yeah, these little fungoirs, oh, that attack wasn't all that great, but uh, they do have attacks that can be pretty, pretty hardcore. So let's get the Waka Flock of Flames in. All right. Got I kind of feel like having a, oh, go ahead. Uh, a battle kind of where I just throw a bunch of defense so I can rebuild my. Uh, Overdrives. Yeah, uh, you should have learned. Uh, hold on a minute. Talking to somebody. All right. Uh, you talk to that first guy. He gives you a soft ring. One okay. of the guys. All right. We are gonna use black magic fire with Yuna, and she's gonna wreck this fungoir. Um. So you should have actually learned a few, a few different overdrive modes for different people by now. Uh, mostly it's just going to be Stoic and Comrade. Stoic is damage taken, and Comrade is like other people damage taken, like you get in overdrive. Um, um, well, but that, that, that's not a lot, just because, like, you know, there's two other people. So obviously they're going to get, like, attacked more, if you know what I'm saying. Right. Ooh, I just had my first encounter with a bite bug. Wow, really? That's... <laughs> Come on now, Square Enix. That's the best you could do. <laughs> they just got lazy with the names in this game. They're like, man, we wrote such a good story. Let's wreck it with stupid monster names. <laughs> oh, boy. Ooh, Lulu's poisoned. Uh, oh, Titus with that counter attack. 
Instant kill. Damn. He don't play no games. <laughs> I got T's right on the bench for right now. Lulu's gonna need some cure too. I'm gonna hit Kam Kamari's gonna cure her. Yeah, yeah, careful with those bite bugs, they do poison damage, so. Yeah. Not that uh, we really need to worry about it too much, but you know. Well, poison actually stays with you after the battle. Uh, you Ooh. lose HP every step you right. take. Right, but I'm saying in terms of in the actual battle itself, it's not going to be like awful or nothing. It can be actually if uh, every turn you take, you take damage, and it's usually quite a bit. Uh -huh. I cast Asuna with the unit to get it off herself, so. Alright, and then I've got a sphere upgrade I can do with uh, Orin, so I'm going to do that real quick. Oh, I forgot to use Orin in this battle, as a matter of fact, so. Well, oh, whatever. It's fine. Uh, <laughs> uh, oh, I guess I don't have a full power sphere anymore. I got 94 now. My bad. <laughs> uh, finally, I learned uh, Fira, Fira, Fira with Lulu. Fira, you dumbass. Fira, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I had a special moment right there. Fira, Fira. <laughs> Yeah. So watch out for those basilisks. Uh, they have a stone uh, glare or something like that. Like instantly kills you, or not kills you, but eliminates you from battle. Oh, awesome! Yeah, yeah. Uh, I haven't run into one. Uh, is that that long like snake looking thing? thing or? Yeah. Yeah, like a half dragon, half cobra looking thing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I got it. Alright, Jerky's. Oh wow, 2,000 health. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. Overkill! Um, wow, 1,000 damage on Fire Up. Wow. Yeah, oh, don't touch on up. Yuna! No! Don't do that to Yuna. Dang. Oh my god, another Stone Gaze, but it missed Orn. That's crazy. Two Stone Gazes in one turn? That's crazy. Oh, that's who I, who I wanted to attack. Damn it. Oh, Stone Gaze on Jerkulees. That's right, he got it's attacking, so. <laughs> uh, Alright, I'm gonna try and kill this big bastard as quick as possible. Got a weak physical attack, but all right, we're gonna bring in Yuna, and then you're gonna drop the lightning on this little big bad. Oh, nope, no, you're not gonna drop lightning because it does half damage. <laughs> you're gonna drop the fire. You're gonna burn it down. I don't know, you're under, really. Burn it down. Yeah. Uh, well, we have Orin attack it. Ah, uh, I almost killed him. Not quite, but oh, you know, poisoned again. Uh, all right, you know, black magic, Blizzara. On this little bite bug bastard, so quit poisoning us. Stone gaze. Oh, thankfully it missed Orin. Now Orin, kill the crap out of this damn thing. Yeah, from what I've noticed in my playthroughs, yeah. Orin is kind of resistant to that stone touch stuff. I don't know why. Hey, who cares? I ain't good to know. Yeah. And you should get uh, some decent armor oh, and or uh, weapons from that battle. Uh, some stone touch stuff and like stuff yeah. like that. Uh, stone touch is really valuable because it like more or less instantly kills the enemy, but you cannot get an overkill from it because it doesn't do actual damage. It just does the stone effect. Right. Um, 
And then Asuna will cure that petrification. So Yes. Which I did not know, because I've had Jerkulees just stuck over there. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> bro. That's savage. No, I just wasn't paying attention. Yeah. I don't like the asshole, what can I say? <laughs> uh, skill extract mana. Get it, Lulu. Get him, get him. Send a little ragamuffin ragdoll as ass. And that uh, mm -hmm. that soft ring, if you picked it up, it's for Yuna, and it makes her stone proof, which means impossible for that stone effect. Uh, oh, but I will still enough. favor the Echo Ring, which is HP plus 10% and a Silence Ward, because right. uh, stone proof, I can at least get Kamari out and cure it. Right. I can cure the Silence Ward too, but plus 10% HP as well, so. Alright, I got a question for you. I've got a plus four magic, uh, plus one accuracy, and then a plus three defense, but after that I'm going to have to backtrack. So is it really worth going down there to get, or... Well, I'm gonna, if I want to max them out, I'm going to have to do it anyway, so I might as well just... Yeah, I would Second say just try to now. eliminate, like, back, like try to get everything within range, like, within reason, so you're not backtracking as much, right. like, towards the end of the game. Cause... Right. Yeah, that's, yeah, what well, I was just kind of more yeah. or less. Mm. All right. Uh... <laughs> ability sphere, what's that unlock? The ability drain. Okay, sure, we'll unlock that. Now I have a curious option. All right, with Waka, I can go over on my next one to the drain, and then I can use level one unlock, and then uh, from there I can actually go get those uh, water, uh, fire, uh, and all that with Waka, um, and then back track with him and then get him more towards like that uh silence buster route and stuff um but just... I, I if i remember waka really isn't that powerful with his magic but he's not like the weakest one either uh but his is more well, sure. definitely more physical attack and like accuracy um, um well here, here's the other thing though too if i'm gonna get that uh water and the fire i'm gonna have to go over i uh, like can't unlock it anyway. Shit. Um. Because uh, we have to use a Lux Sphere to activate it, so. And we don't ha have a Lux Sphere right now, so. Um. What I was gonna say, because I put that uh, Luck, uh, that raised Luck by four. Like right in the center of that water of fire and all that stuff. Um, oh, okay. But I don't have, but I don't have a luck sphere, so I might start moving Waka that way, and then just kind of stall them all out until I get a lux enough luck spheres to actually activate it, and then move them back because it's not that far and to get over there with Waka. It's gonna take one, two, three, five. Just to get Thundera, it's going to take five turns. But going back, it's going to take like three turns or whatever, so it's not that bad. Right. Um, plus, just to have that extra magic with the Waka, I think it's worth it, even if it's not going to be as strong. It's better than not having, or it's better than having nothing at all. Right, true. Um, in my opinion, anyway. Um, <laughs> plus, over there, there's also a plus 20 for the magic, so it's kind of worth kind of running over there just to grab that too, because Walk has a really low amount of MP, so. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And then we're gonna move with Kamari. Woohoo! And then we're gonna activate a 200 per 200 increase in HP, which Kamari's ass and needs desperately. And then, Okay, I'm gonna have to wait till the next turn to do that. 
but I gotta start backtracking with Lulu actually next time I power her up. But I was talking about uh Ooh. That's a toughie. That is a toughie. Because right now, if I unlock this level one with Lulu, if I go back, I probably, well, all I have to do is Kamari to unlock it, but there's a magic and then there's a Lux Sphere over there. When do we start getting the Lux Spheres or whatever? Um, honestly, I don't really remember. I just remember that they are kind of rare. Um, we could probably awesome. search that up, though. Uh, if we yeah, uh, let's do that uh, between episodes or whatever. So yeah, we're not wasting any more time just looking at the sphere grid. Right. All right I'm I would like make a note of that now. so we don't forget or something like that. Yeah. All right. I just got another encounter. Uh, with one of those uh, uh, ballasts or whatever, bacillus or whatever, I don't know. Um, you know, you were out there, use black magic, use blizzard. 887. Uh, what magic? Special. Yeah, you know, actually, I will, uh, I will use the extract power. Oh, no. Oh, okay, I didn't attack the right guy. Okay. Mm -hmm. Special. Fire. Uh, there's no way to use blizzard on. We're going to freeze this lizard. Weak. Oh, when you turn Jerkulees to stone again. Again. <laughs> wow, these fungalars are just burning Lulu or Yuna. <laughs> burning her ass alive. They are not nice. Yeah, Locker they killed off. Uh, HP. They killed off Waka. Oh, another thing I wanted to mention is if your character is uh, stone, we'll call it, uh, like at the end of the battle, they actually won't gain XP because it kind of reads it as like you're knocked out at the time. Right. So just a right. warning on that. Yeah, I kind of <laughs> figured as much. But yeah, good reminder though. Appreciate that. All right, Jerky Lee's uh, skill. Let's check power. Get his ass. Come on, overkill. All right, it wasn't overkill, but did 680, so I'll take it. Yuna, I want you to heal yourself because you're still that weak. <laughs> I actually uh, just learned the overdrive mode Slayer with Titus, which allows me to gain uh, every time I defeat an enemy. Which I like because he's actually pretty powerful for me, so it works out. And upgrading Waka here with some magic and drain. And uh, looks like we lost uh, Mr. General Chaos. I don't know if his power went out or if his internet went out. Uh, I should know pretty soon here. Well, we're going to go down and we're going to learn water up with Lulu. So slowly getting there with her. Mega Potion, nice. And we're gonna switch that overdrive mode, Slayer with Titus. Wow, 
Wow, I missed. Oh, wow, I missed both attempts. Still got the overkill, though. Let's end this. That seems like General Chaos's uh, Wi Fi did go out. Uh, but he'll still be at the same point in the game. Uh, his video might... Actually, his video will still be the same, so... He just had to leave the party. We're gonna heal with Kamari. Anybody else need to be healed? Maybe walk a little bit. I apologize for the pause, but we're just going to wait for uh, General Chaos to get back in the party uh, and view this cutscene. I, uh, I really enjoy playing this game, though. Uh, just saw a post uh, on Facebook about it being uh, 17 years uh since this game released and uh wow like it almost makes me feel old a little bit but uh i still enjoy playing this game uh and all the reviews i heard they're oh i miss playing this game i miss playing this game you know what? You, you can buy it and play it you don't have to miss playing it you can play it it's high replay value which is very rare these days usually these days you kind of you know, you replay, but it's just not as fun. This one, I think it's it's fun all the time. Uh, especially with the, like, all the side quests, you know, like Blitzball uh, is huge. A lot of people uh, talk about, you know, a separate save file just to play Blitzball or something like that, you know, like, it's really fun. So a lot, a lot of different aspects to this game make it a lot of fun. All the challenges to get the ultimate weapons, uh, some are ridiculous, I'll admit. Uh, the 200 lightning bolts, the the chocobo race. The chocobo race, I think, is more doable than the lightning bolt challenge. Uh, you have to dodge like 200. I think you got to dodge them consecutively without without missing one, which is a little bit hard to do.
All right, uh, I think we're just gonna skip ahead. Seems like General Chaos is gonna go ahead a little bit. The how how long are those energy? Still a ways. First down the moon flow to the Guado city of Guado Salam. Then we cross the Thunder Plains to the temple of Makalania. Oh, boy. <laughs> and before that, we get to pray at the temple in Jose. We can't just skip all that. Can we? Huh? Mm -mm. I have to pray to the faith in every temple in order to earn the final Aeon. That's a summoner's training. She's got to prepare mind and body, all just to get ready for the final summoning. Hmm. Must be tough, Yuna. <laughs> I'll be fine with you here. Oh, damn. We're actually going to go left here. I can't. For you, boss. boss. Don't tell Yuna you know about Sin and Jept. Huh? You know her. She would distance herself from you. We do not want that. I see. I think. Yeah, but even if I did say something, no one believed me, you know? Yuna would. Ah, you have a point. Come to think of it, did I really have to know about Jept? What about my feelings? Better than you finding out at a critical moment, becoming emotional. What? Me? Emotional? <laughs> I heard you were quite the crybaby. Yeah, maybe when I was a kid. <laughs> maybe even a little now. Just a little. Hey, I still don't buy your story, you hear? Still can't go back. Alright, so we'll push forward here. Whoa! Yuna, it is good to see you and your companions are well. Yourselves as well, Captain. We were worried. Praise be to Yevon. <sighs> We escaped with our lives, but our troops were decimated. Of all our chocobos, only this one made it. We make pretty poor chocobo-mounted forces without chocobos. We turned our backs on the teachings and cast away our faith. This, this is our just reward. So many died in vain. It was a mistake. Just you know, but don't worry, we're here for you. We should... Is that the Jose Temple? The Lightning Mushroom Rock. It only opens when a summoner is addressing the faith. That means another summoner's already in there. Another summoner? What if it's Donna? We have to hurry. Right! In we go! I would pray for those. But how? I 
I've been thinking about the, the monks said we. I think I'm going to end the episode here. Uh, General Chaos is having a little bit of internet issues right now. Uh, so we'll, we, we will get episode 20 once he is back up and running. I want to thank everybody for watching. Uh, again, my YouTube is the Dead Man's Hand. The Dead Man's Hand 420. My Twitch is Bill Compton underscore 1835. Uh, follow me on there. I always uh, stream this game on there. And then if you want a game with me, um, add me up. My PSN is Bill underscore Compton 1835. So once again, thank you for watching. And we will see you on the next episode.